Good morning, little darling. You sure look nice today. Are you ready for another day at the grist mill? They messed up my coffee order. It tasted like warm milk with cinnamon powder. Well, I be darn sorry to hear that. The boss wanted us to work on the National Archives project today. I told them that I wanted a caramel macchiato. I do not understand how they could mess that up. This sounds important to you like water to a goldfish. Should we walk back and get it all fixed up? No. It's not worth the time to walk there. It's just over yonder. Besides, you're stuck on it like a mouse on a glue trap. If I don't get you unstuck, then you will be cranky all day. No, I won't. And what makes you think that I will be cranky? You're madder than a cat tossed in a swimming pool and you won't purr until you've had your Starbucks. I am not mad. Okay. Just settle down, my princess. We can get your coffee before we get started. It will make you feel better. No. Just forget it. I will talk to Z when I see her again. She will give me a card for a free cup. Well, I'm glad we got that apple cart up right. It's best if we get started on the National Archives project before the boss gets here. Ah, uh, okay. Our work would be so much better with a good cup of caramel macchiato. I think we should get you a cup now so I can have a drama-free day. You have no faith in me. I am going to make you eat your words. You haven't let go, have you? You were still pissed. It's just a cup of coffee. No, I am not pissed. It's not just a cup of coffee. Oh, just forget about it. I already have. I'm just waiting for you to forget about it too. Now let's get out of this rut we're in. The National Archives account is one of our most important customers. The boss wants us to get this right. Have you gone over the plans? Plans? Ah, uh, right, plans. I went over the plans last night. Are you okay? It's just that damn caramel macchiato. It really irks me that they messed it up. And our boss is gonna be really irked if we mess this up. We shall get your coffee. No. I'm fine. I don't think so. I am. I think you're gonna melt down like Chernobyl in the summertime. Whatever. Okay, great. Now we can move on again. The boss wants us to draft up plans for a vestibule behind the rotunda where the charters of freedom are kept. He wants it to be just right. With all them public visitors, he wants to make sure it looks sharper than an axe the day before Thanksgiving. The plan calls for a Corinthian-style vestibule like the one at the Oracle in Delphi. It is to match the building's overall architecture. Are you following? Ah, uh, yes. Vestibular. Of course. Continue. It is to match the building's overall architecture like tiger's tail and a patch of cat tails to fit in with the designs of the other federal buildings near the National Mall. The marble and tile work have to be first class and is to match better than Rembrandt's Sistine Chapel and cut in color to the original tile in the rotunda. Right. And how hard is it to do something like that? It's simple. How can you mess up something that easy? Actually it is very hard to do that and Rembrandt would be breaking a sweat over it. But you were talking about that coffee again, aren't you? Gonio de la Madre. I am so damn pissed off. How could they mess up my order? Ugh. Have you got scarlet fever? It's just a cup of coffee. Ugh. I am so mad. Madder than a cat thrown in a swimming pool. See, I told you, you were mad.